Hi everyone, it's Bobby Joe, and welcome to my home. I am bringing to you the final reveal of our album with de decorations in it and things like that. Um, I really appreciate you sticking with me through this tutorial. I know it was long, but I assure you that I do that to make sure that I'm putting out something that's got a lot of my heart into it because I, that's what I like receiving from, uh, why I like receiving handmade things is because somebody has put their heart into that. And yeah, that's my main objective. But we did a lot of work, so let's see how it looks decorated. And here it is. So we have a little cameo here um, and part of the chain moves, a few little paper roses. This here was made by uh, Linda at uh, Linda uh, H-65, I believe. Um, her link will be down below. She does some awesome projects. And this um, I left blank so that my friend can put whatever she wants in there. I just have this as a tie. I made it long enough so that if she wanted to open it on the side as well, she could. But I just wrapped it around a few times and um, made a tie out of it. If you turn to the spine, I've got this little um, antique um, uh, paper clip. And I have added uh, another friend of mine, uh, Car uh, Carlene. Um, I will put her link below as well. She does some fantastic projects uh, also. And um, also, both Linda and her do hauls. So, um, yeah, it's yeah, definitely check them out, but this is one of her little tags and I thought it looked perfect on the, on the back of, um, on the spine. This is a wooden tag that she colored and, uh, put one of the older looking pictures on it. So I put all of my hardware on so I've got th this this actually um, I what I did with it is I made sure that I Gorilla glued it um, in, a, in addition since I these are actually brads that hold it on however because I didn't want um, to put those in initially um, I just cut them off and then Gorilla glued them on so that they look, they don't look any different. All right, so this is our first page. This is the little pocket that we made. And I've got, I added some trim there and I've got one of my clusters. And then this is just um, pull out. I did not, I thought that's, this had enough going on, so I didn't put anything there, um, but yeah, I, I went ahead and distressed all of the tags and things like that. If we flip over, we've got a few more tags, um, I've got one here that's kind of layered, um, and in addition, I have one of my wax melts on this page. And underneath is, um, to be honest, part of the Kleenex box. <laughs> it is, a, it, this is, um, yeah, a punch out of, of some, and like, um, vintage, uh, Kleenex, uh, that vintage paper on the Kleenex box. These are just a die that I have. And then the Be Brave is from the Brights of um, sticker book from Mambi for planning. There's our little girl. Just added a couple of couple of things to her. I didn't want to take too much away from her. 
and then just added a couple of things in there to have to pull out. I added this to the, the page. Um, it's going to a friend, so I wanted that there. Carlene gave me this um, uh, this uh, butterfly one time, and Linda also gave me this. Um, I believe she made it. It's gorgeous, and uh, yeah. So those that's their contributions. And then we have in here, we've got a few things. We've got one of the, um, a tag in back of there, a pink one, a little tag like this. This, These are the cutouts to one of the paper pads. On this one, I did another little long cluster um, for my flip up. So, just wanted something there to ground it a little bit. So, um, then I've got another one of my clusters. This is the tuck spot. I Linda gave me a whole bunch of ribbon, and I thought this just went really well with this cluster. So I tucked these couple of things in, and I've got my. I put one of um, these longer um, ephemeras on the last on the file folder, and I had just sewed up the up the middle, added a couple of my dies to it, and then the final page is where we had the double pocket kind of thing. We didn't do much with that as well. Um, I let these kind of take control of it. Um, but yeah, on the other page, I did add um, some ribbon here just to give it some texture. Added uh, some spectro uh, Spectrum Noir um, glitter. And this was already glittered from the paper pad. I cut him out. It's the it's similar paper to what's underneath. I just wanted a 3D effect there, so that uh, we have something point of interest, especially since I've got the ribbon there. So I think it came out really well. I am going to be very happy to to send this to my friend, and um, hopefully she'll be surprised. And yeah, that's. That's our, our album, you guys. Thank you so much again for um, staying with me through it. And I hope I was able to pass on some kind of knowledge to you. And uh, yeah, have a good day. Bye.